What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to In For Movies. Well, uh, I thought I'd do something a little bit different, uh, showing off my uh, my collection, uh, specifically 4K titles here. Um, this is going to be... I'm roughly going to rank my action movies when it comes to the 4K movies. Now, I have 41 movies here. And... Uh, these are specifically action. There's no like fantasy action in here. Um, there might be one that's a bit of a stretch. Uh, but uh, so you'll you'll see it when it when it uh, when it comes to comes to it. Um, I don't have any comic book movies in here, so no uh, so no DC or or uh, or Marvel. Uh, and then uh, adventure, I've I've taken out because adventure is a separate uh, separate genre for me when it comes to my collection. But anyways, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, rank these off of the movies by themselves, not not the 4K quality with uh, with picture and and audio because a lot of these uh, I haven't uh, I haven't watched the 4Ks or anything like that. So. Uh, I thought that would be pretty cool. Just go from title to title and uh, and put it in a put it in a a, a ranking and uh, and seeing what's better than what and and whatnot. So uh, a lot of these, uh, some of them are are alpha, uh, the ones I'm pulling off from here. But uh, but yeah, you'll catch on. All right. So this is one of the one of the newest used ones I got here. Is we got uh, First Blood. Uh, this is like the first uh, Rambo movie, and so I got that for uh, thirteen dollars used. So we're gonna place that right there, right on the bottom here. Okay, all right. And then up next is uh, we go from a movie that's uh, that's an old '80s classic to a movie that just came out this year, and that is Nobody. And I'm going to say nobody is better than First Blood. Okay. And then we have the Hitman's Bodyguard. And I'm going to put that better than First Blood. I'm sorry, I'm not a Rambo. Like, I'm not a Rambo fan. So we're going to put that right there. All right. Angel Has Fallen is going to go actually below First Blood because Angel Has Fallen is 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 a good installment in that uh, in that series, but uh, we'll put that below First Blood. And then we have the First Purge. Totally an action movie that could actually happen. It's the first purge. All right, we'll put that underneath Angel Has Fallen. All right. <laughs> Fate of the Furious. So, Fate of the Furious. Um, this one's going to get interesting. I'm going to put this... Um, Fast Five. Fast Five is going to go. This is my this is my favorite of the uh, of the Fast and Furious movies. Uh, so I'm actually going to put that number one right now. So we're going to put that above Nobody. All right. Uh, Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift is going to go. Uh, the Hitman's Bodyguard, yeah. I'm already getting dislikes so that that uh, First Blood is below Tokyo Drift. Alright, so Tomb Raider. 
the one with Alicia Vikander, is going to go... Because this one is like an, an action, but it's like slightly adventure, but, uh, but I'm thinking it's more like action. Uh, we're going to go with... Hmm... I'm going to put it between Angel Has Fallen and Tomb Raider. All right. And then, of course, we got the classic steelbook here for speed. Um, we're going to place that number one. Come on. Who doesn't like speed? Pretty soon these are going to be out of camera. Uh skyscraper um we're gonna place skyscraper ahead of fate of the furious but say that angel has fallen is better than skyscraper all right oh man sicario um, Sicario would be, wow, Sicario, dude. Um, I don't know, <sighs> Sicario, yeah, let's put Sicario right there. Speed is still, like, like, speed is still so good. All right, Salt with Angelina Jolie is... Man, this is getting kind of complicated here. Uh, early, yeah. Um, we're going to place that at Tokyo Drift, or ahead of Tokyo Drift. Alright, this is one that I recently actually watched, I think for the first time, Red Heat, old one with uh, Schwarzenegger and Belushi. Um, I thought it was alright. But, I'm going to place it down here, between, between sky, Skyscraper and... Angel has fallen. It's going to be getting pretty complicated really fast. All right. Rambo, Last Blood. Well, I will say First Blood is better than this one. Uh, Tomb Raider is better. Angel has fallen is better. I'm going to place this right under Angel Has Fallen. I'm sorry, I like Angel Has Fallen. It's a good movie. Alright. Now You See Me. Not a huge fan of Now You See Me. Um, so, we're going to go with... Um, Hmm. I'm actually going to do Skyscraper before Now You See Me. Because I don't like, I don't like Now You See Me. Oh man. Mission Impossible Fallout. I'm going to go with, I know a lot of people love this. I say it's the best action movie ever. Um, I'm actually going to place Mission Impossible Fallout. They're going to get a lot of dislikes for this one. Uh, below Fast Five. All right. 
<laughs> we have to move this over here. Let me move this over there. All right. Uh, this is the only one I have on, on 4K right now. The other two are on uh, regular Blu-ray. Uh, Maze Run of the Death Cure. Uh, it's not entirely like fantasy. This is kind of like a realistic thing. So I don't think it's like fantasy because this uh, like something like this could like eventually happen. I'm thinking. Um, so we have the Death Cure here. And which is the third one of the series, obviously. Um, I actually like this series, and we're gonna go with we're gonna place that right above salt. Oh man, Mad Max Fury Road, uh, one of the best action movies in my opinion, and we're actually, I'm go actually going to place that on top of speed, I know, I know we're actually placing that on speed, it literally is on, <laughs> oh man, another, another, Killer selection here. Leon the Professional. Uh, Leon the Professional will go. Man. I'm going to place that below Mad Max Ferry Road, but above speed. So, so far, the top two are. Uh, Mad Max Fury Road and Leon the Professional. Now we got John Wick movies here, kind of in backwards here. Uh, John Wick Chapter Three is going to. Uh, this is like a healthy like nine. Um, I'm going to place this between Nobody and Fallout. John Wick check for two. Uh, <laughs> These are so good. Um, place this top of the Hitman's Bodyguard in between nobody. Because yeah, I like because I like John Wick Chapter Three a lot better. Oh my goodness! All right, so John Wick. I don't, oh man, in the long run, I don't see John Wick better than Fallout, so we're going to place it right above John Wick Chapter 3. Alright. Jack Reacher, never go back. I remember I picked this up at uh, Walmart for like less than $7, so I thought that was a really good deal that one night. Um, so, John Wick, never go back. Um... Uh, <laughs> Not the greatest. <laughs> um, we're going to put this clear almost halfway down. Uh, and we're going to put it ahead of Rambo. Oh, man. The stack is getting big. Jack Reacher. Uh, 
Yeah, this one's gonna go. This one's gonna go right above Jack Reacher. Never go back. I'm not like I said. I'm not a big fan of of the Jack Reacher series. I'm gonna start doing two piles here. So. Place those right there, and those right there, so you can see what I got so far there. All right. Okay. Oh man, this is another killer one here. Gladiator, action movie. Could probably totally happen back then. <laughs> uh, and it's not really an, not really an adventure movie because they don't really go in any place. I mean, they do, but it's not. So, action movie, but where does it fall between Sicario, Speed, Leon the Professional, and Mad Max Fury Road? Um, I think it's, I think it's better than Sicario, uh, but not as good as Speed. So, we're going to actually place this number four uh, to Sicario. Here we go. All right. Now we're getting back into Fast and Furious a little bit. We got Furious 7. Furious 7. That looks about right. Furious 7 right in front of Assault. Because I don't think it's as good as Tokyo Drift. But, yeah. <laughs> Hobbs and Shaw. Could totally happen. The only thing that throws this off is the uh, is the villain and him getting his, uh, his suit. Uh, but, uh... This one would be Hobbs and Shaw. We're going to put this ahead of Jack Reacher. Sorry to all those Jack Reacher fans out there. Fast and Furious 6. Um, it's a step down from Fast and 5. Uh, I'm place that above salt. So fast seven and then fast six. Yeah. Alright. Fast and Furious. Uh one the, the this is the fourth movie. And I'm not a huge fan on this one. Uh, so we're gonna. We're gonna place this. Above Jack Reacher. But I'm gonna say that. Um, Hobbs and Shaw is better than Fast and Furious. Ooh, -hoo. dread with the sleep, dread. Um, I need to rewatch this. This is a really good movie. I'm gonna place dread right in front of John Wick. All right. Next up is Die Hard movie. Yes, it's a Christmas movie, but it's an action movie first. So Die Hard is going to go uh, 
Inferno Speed. But we're going to put Leon the Professional ahead of Die Hard. Because I love Leon the Professional. And no, it's not just because it's got Natalie Foreman in there. I just, I just love it as an action movie. Uh, so now we have Crank. This is the, this is the wild card of, of the collection here. Because I love Crank. Crank is so much fun. I remember seeing it in theaters. Blew me away. Um, oh, man. Oh, man. This is crazy. Oh, man. I love Crank. Oh, man. I want to place Crank right after Fallout. I love it. I love it so much. Okay, only got eight more titles here. All right, <laughs> another killer one. Collateral with Tom Cruise and Jamie Foxx. I need to rewatch it. Um, I'm going to place it between John Wick and John Wick Chapter 3. All the fans of action movies out there are probably going to be like, yeah, You're crazy! What is going on? Oh, wow. Okay. Cold Pursuit. Um, like, it's not the greatest from Liam Neeson. Um, but I'd rather rewatch this one than the Jack Reacher movies. So, we're going to place this I do have I did find a few more three more titles here that I'm going to include. Uh so we're going to stretch this to, you know, 44 or 45 or whatever. So, one of them was a Hunter Killer, uh, about, a, about a submarine action movie. And so, I really do like this movie. What was cool about this is that my dad is like, um, like 70. And um, we, uh, he saw this movie. And he said that this was the best depiction of, of uh, the way it was on a submarine and stuff like that. Uh, so that was pretty cool. So Hunter Killer is going to... We're going to place this below Tokyo Drift. Classic Top Gun here. Top Gun will go... Let's see. Is it better than the Hitman's Bodyguard? 
I don't know. Is it better than Death Race or Death Cure? We're going to place it, place Top Gun above Furious 7. How about that? All right. Fast and the Furious, original one. Uh, this is going to go... I'm going to slap this ahead of Hitman's Bodyguard. Because I don't think... Oh, the original Fast and Furious, like, it's not in the same category as John Wick's. I mean, it is, genre-wise, but it doesn't really touch the trilogy there. So, alright. So, Backdraft. Uh, it's been a while since I've seen this one. But, I'm going to go with Backdraft. Uh, to be safe. I'm going to place that above Fast and Furious. But not as good as John Wick Chapter 2. Baby Driver. Controversial here. Baby Driver will go... Below Dread. I, I, I know that's a controversial pick. Almost done here. I got four more titles. Atomic Blonde with Charlize Theron. Um... I really, I, I really do like this one. Uh, that being said, we are going to place this one below Fast and Furious 6. Anna. <laughs> Poor Anna. Um... <laughs> Anna. Um, <laughs> she's looking at you like, I dare you to place me someplace really low. Yeah, this is going to go really low. We're actually going to put this... <laughs> I'm going to say that the first purge is better than Anna. Uh... <laughs> There's people out there saying... What are you doing? It looks so good. Oh man, oh man. Shit's gonna fall over. This is crazy, this is crazy, this is crazy. Comment down below what that's from. This is crazy, this is crazy, this is crazy. Uh, American Assassin, American Assassin, uh, oh shit, um, we're gonna sneak that in between Jack Reacher and Cold Pursuit. Okay, and then save one of the best for last. Air Force One. Get off my plane. Awesome classic here from Harrison Ford. And uh, we're going to place it. It is so good, people.
it's going right there. It's going Sicario's right ahead of Air Force One. I'm sorry, Air Force One is so good. It's so good. All right. There it is. There's my ranking. Um, trying to see if I can get everything all together. Okay, so this is my ranking here. Alright. So we have, starting from the bottom, Anna, The First Purge, Fate of the Furious, Now You See Me, Skyscraper, Red Heat, Rainbow Last Blood, Jack Reacher Never Go Back, Jack Reacher, American Assassin, Cold Pursuit, Fast and Furious, Hobbs and Shaw, Angel Has Fallen, Tomb Raider, First Blood, Hunter Killer, uh, Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift, Salt, Atomic Blonde, Fast and Furious 6, Fast and Furious 7, Top Gun, Maze Runner The Death Cure, uh, The Hitman's Bodyguard, Fast and the Furious, and Backdraft. And then coming over here we have John Wick Chapter 2, Nobody. John Wick Chapter 3, Parabell Parabellum, Collateral, John Wick, Baby Driver, Dread, and I believe, uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Entering into the top 10, Crank, Mission Impossible Fallout, Fast Five, Air Force One, Sicario, Gladiator, Speed, Die Hard, Leon the Professional, and Mad Max Fury Road. So, there you go. There is uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, yep. 44 of my 4Ks, these are all action genres, all of them ranked, and uh, yeah, just, just a video uh, that I've been thinking about doing. I might continue, uh, see how successful this video is, and, uh, and then move on from there, like adventure, animated, and such and such um, so we'll we'll see how good this video does but uh, but in my opinion uh, my number one action movie in my collection is Mad Max Fury Road all right I want to thank everybody for watching taking the time to watch don't forget to subscribe like this video for the heck of it comment down below which one out of these out of these movies? What are the better 4Ks that you might have um, have seen? Uh, tell me how wrong I am on my on some of my choices. And um, uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to potentially doing the other genres. And uh, yeah, uh, remember all uh, these codes are most likely have already been used. Uh, or or given away and, and giveaways so m most likely these don't have codes at all so don't don't please don't ask for codes I appreciate it and until my next ranking of my 4k movies that'll do it take care everybody bye bye